Hey guys, so guess what? Your girl did some shopping. Are you surprised? Sorry, my room's a little bit of a mess behind me, and I cleaned my room, and like my whole camera setup, like, kind of got messed up. Like, it's not exactly how I had it because I had it like a mess pile. So, sorry if it's like different, but I try my best. So, first off, I went to Charlotte Russe. And I'm going to start out with clothes in case that's like what you want to watch. And then at the end, if you're interested, I have some stuff from Dollar Tree and like a few beauty things from Walmart just to throw in. But um, apparently my Charlotte Russe, I haven't been to the mall since probably Black Friday. I don't go to the mall anymore because I was going to put his closet. And apparently my Charlotte Russe is closing. It was like the last two days of the store being open. So they didn't have much left, but like the whole store was 70% off. So... I mean, come on. So, I got some stuff. So, and they gave me the hangers and everything because, you know, they're closing. They don't need them anymore. So, like, sorry if that's weird, but, like, the stuff is on hangers. So, first I got, let me pull these out. I think I got, hold on. So, I got a pair of jeans because I'm fat now and, like, none of my jeans or shorts fit me anymore. So, and these are skin tight legging, okay, and I'm gonna say like the tag price, but everything was 70% off of that. So these were originally $29.99, but then they were actually on sale for $14.99, and then I got 70% off that, so. So they're just like a really dark denim wash, and I actually don't like, I like holes in shorts, but I don't like holes in jeans, I know that's kind of weird, but I don't. So they're just like a dark denim wash, and then I also, I these were cute. I've never been into this, but these are, um, like, gray. I don't know why I couldn't think that word, but they're just, like, a gray pair of jeans. I don't know. I don't wear colored jeans. Like, actually, I'm such a liar. I love maroon jeans, but I've never had a gray pair of jeans. Like, I have, I wear black jeans when I go to work, but, like, I've had denim, I've had khaki, I've had maroon, but I've never had a pair of gray jeans, so I don't know. I just wanted to try it out. And then I found one pair of shorts, so they have like a couple buttons, they have some distressing and they're like frayed at the bottom. They're just like playing at the back with that little thing and, oh wait, I didn't say the price of these jeans. These ones were um, originally $29.99 and then these, do they not have the tag on them? WTF, I'm kidding, I'm so annoying. Okay, well, these don't even have a tag on them, so I don't really know. They were probably, like, 20, 30 bucks originally. Then I got two pairs of leggings. So these ones are actually high-waisted, and they were originally $10.99, so these were, like, really cheap. But they're just, like, a gray pair of leggings, you know. I wear leggings pretty much every day. I'm trying to get myself to wear jeans, but, like, on a regular basis, I wear leggings every day, so. And then I got these ones. I don't own a pair of leggings this color, so I thought this was cute. It's, like, a dusty rosy pink color and these are also high-waisted and these were originally $10.99 so I thought these were cute and they were cheap then okay this is like out of my comfort zone I wanted to try it out so oh my god what happened to it okay this was originally $42.99, they are tripping. I would never pay that for any clothing in my life. I'm like, girl, I'll be getting the deals of Plato's Closet. You, $42.99, you got me messed up. But anyway, so it's like this really pretty rosy crochet with like a nude slip underneath. But then at the bottom, it has this like kind of peplum style. I don't know. It's really different, but I thought it was really pretty on. I just wanted to try it out, so... I got that. Oh, I got another pair of jeans. I forgot. I'm sorry. These ones are... I don't know if these are high-waisted. But they were originally $32.99. And they're just like a... They have like a couple buttons. And they're just like a light wash pair of jeans. They're getting like really washed out. This is like the actual color. They're like a really light denim blue. And then... I got this sweater. I'm trying not to buy any more winter clothes because I have a lot and it's, you know, March. It's going to be April soon and then it's going to be May. So it's technically like officially we had the first day of spring. So I'm trying not to buy more winter clothes. But this was, you know, really cheap. It was, 
Are you serious? Is there like legit no tag on this? I'm actually pissed. Anyway, it was cheap. It's just like this red, if you can kind of see that, like, I don't know. What is that called? Anyway, but it's just red, and I love red. It's like one of my favorite colors to wear, so I got that. And the reason I'm trying, I'm actually leaving for Phoenix, Arizona in like, oh, tonight. <laughs> like really late tonight at like 3 in the morning. So I know they have tanker outlets there. So I've been saving money, so I know I'm going to have a huge haul when I get back. So I'm trying to get this filmed, edited, and uploaded today. So that's my goal. Um. Anyway, so then I got this, and this was originally $10.99. And it's just like this little black bralette with a cute little cutout right here. And I just thought this would be really comfy. If I don't feel like wearing a real bra, this would be really comfy to throw on. And then I'm pretty loyal to Victoria's Secret underwear. But these were originally $3.50, so they were like dirt cheap. So I just got three pairs of underwear, and that is actually everything I got at Charlotte Russe. And then I have some other stuff. So at Walmart, I got Jolly Ranchers to eat on the plane. And then I have been obsessed with this mascara, and it's literally $4. I really wanted to get the waterproof version, but I guess they don't have one. So, it's the Great Lash Lots of Lashes. It was four bucks. I was like, that is so cheap. But I actually really like this mascara. It's really old. It's like a rediscovered favorite of mine. And then I wanted to get a waterproof mascara, so I just got one of my favorites. I got the Maybelline Lash Sensational Full Fan Effect, and I got this in the waterproof. And then also, you know, you can't take more than like three ounces on a plane, so I got a little mini dry shampoo. This is the Not Your Mother's Clean Freak Refreshing Dry Shampoo, so I just picked that up. And now we have stuff from Dollar Tree. Um, first off, I got my whole family, like my mom, sister, and stepdad, a bunch of candy because it's the dollar store. And then I got me, fun fact, I'm like obsessed with pumpkin seeds. So I just got two bags of these to take with me to Phoenix. And then the rest, I found out my cousin is pregnant. So I got some baby stuff. So first I got a baby bag, if it'll focus. Just a cute little baby bag. And then I got a bunch of baby stuff. So this has nothing to do with beauty or fashion or anything. So this is just random. This is just... If you're into watching my videos, here's some stuff. So I got... What? This just came off. What the hell does this go to? Okay, well, we'll figure that out later. Here we have a nasal aspirator. That's exciting. Then I got this... Um, little baby bottle and it's like Mickey Mouse. I got this and I had to buy everything like red. Like I had to pick a gender neutral color because we like just found out she's pregnant so we don't know the gender yet. So I got mostly like red stuff because I figured that could be for a girl or boy. And a lot of their stuff was Sesame Street. Like I don't know why. Maybe because that's like an older TV show so it was cheap but like everything was Sesame Street things. So this says Sesame Beginnings. And it's just a little red teeter toy. Then I got this little terry cloth baby bib. I got baby wash, baby shampoo, baby lotion, and baby oil. Then I got some wipes. So these are Sesame Street little wipes, and this has 72 in them. And then I got this little Pampers, like, sensitive one, because, you know, these are, like, the good ones. And that one only has 18. Then I got a little pacifier. And this one is actually Paw Patrol. And it looks like that. I thought it was cute. And then I got, this is exciting, diaper rash cream. You know, I mean, you need this shit when you have a baby. And then this is this thing that, like, totally came undone. I don't have a baby. I don't even know how this goes. But it is just a nurser bottle. So... That's everything I got. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. Your girl's going to go shopping in Phoenix, so I will have a huge Tanger Outlets haul when I get back. So stay tuned for that. I'm only going for four days, so that video shouldn't be too far away. But hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Sorry if this camera angle is weird. I'm pretty sure I'm tilted, but it's not perfect yet. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I love you. Leave requests down below. I always need new video ideas because all I do is hauls because I go shopping all the time. It's like actually a problem. Just retail therapy is like so important to me. So 
that is my defense for it. So, I love you guys. I will see you, hopefully, pretty soon. Okay, I love you. Bye. And, oh wait, really quick, let's establish this. I know I have a huge pimple on my face. Nobody's perfect. Like, leave me alone. Don't hate on me in the comments because you probably get pimples too. And I know it's really annoying, but imagine if it was on your face. I have to deal with it. Like, my life sucks right now. And we're going to take pictures on vacation, so I have to bring foundation because, like, this had to happen right before vacation pictures. Like, I'm actually pissed. Anyway, I love you guys.